Well, look, let's be clear, this was a very, very good result for the Labour Party because what was clear was there was a choice. The Labour Party has been putting forward a positive plan for the future, how we stabilise and grow our economy. So we were putting a positive choice to the electorate in Chester. The government is worn out, tired, has crashed the economy, and the verdict was very, very clearly given. And I think that's a clear message to the Prime Minister, Rishi Sunak, that people are fed up and they want to change, and there's this strong sense now the government has run out of road, run out of ideas, hasn't got a mandate, and it's time for change. Here in Scotland, there's still strong support for the SNP, although some positive uh, results in opinion polls for Labour, but also suggestions in recent polls of a, a lead in favour of independence. How do you make gains here in Scotland? Well, in Scotland, we've been improving our position, and the case I want to make in Scotland is that we should have change in Scotland, but that should be change within the United Kingdom, a positive case for change, and that also an incoming Labour government would clearly have priorities, which I think match where most people are in Scotland, which is dealing with the cost of living crisis, dealing with our economy and getting it growing, making sure we've got the right jobs in the right places, and that Scotland can thrive. So, um, you know, we're, we're doing well in Scotland. We continue to build our case, but it's a very positive case for change. I'm not arguing for the status quo in Scotland. Change uh, of Scotland within change within the United Kingdom. Yes, and a, a report out today suggests that Total may uh, cut its investment in the North Sea as a result of the windfall tax. Um, are you concerned about this policy harming North Sea jobs? The windfall tax is absolutely essential because oil and gas companies have made profits they didn't expect to make and, on the other hand, people are really struggling to pay their bills. So it is right that oil and gas companies pay their fair share. Um, obviously, what I want to see is the push towards renewables. If anything, this is powerful evidence that Labour's case, that we need to rush towards renewables, is the right case. So it gives us lower bills, it gives us independence from Putin so he can't put his boot on our throat, gives us the jobs of the future, and obviously is consistent with our climate obligations. So windfall tax is right, but at the same time, and alongside that, as we've argued, we've got to push on towards renewables. And what's your response to the palace racism row and will you be watching the Harry and Meghan documentary? Well, look, there's no place for racism anywhere and I think uh, the royal family will right to act.